So, we recently received an DIY Apple TV modification that, unfortunately, missed the mark. But instead of focusing on the error, let's use this as a teachable moment to explore the distinction between AC, alternating current, and DC, direct current, power, a crucial aspect for any electronic device. One of our viewer ordered the wrong upgrade kit for his older Apple TV. And to top it off, we've never done a DIY video on this Apple model A1625. As you can see here, the DC board was wired directly into the AC input, which is normally where you plug into household power. AC and DC refer to the flow of electrical current. AC alternates direction periodically, making it ideal for long-distance power transmission. On the other hand, DC flows consistently in one direction, perfect for powering electronics. Understanding these fundamental concepts helps us grasp how devices like the Apple TV need the right type of power input for optimal functionality. Using the incorrect power source can lead to a host of issues, from malfunctions to potential damage. It's crucial to know your device's power requirements to ensure it runs smoothly and has a longer lifespan. In the case of the Apple TV, it's designed to work with a specific type of power input. But before we do that, let's reassemble the Apple TV. Now, let's correct the Apple TV modification. We'll ensure it receives the right power input to guarantee optimal performance. It's a simple fix that highlights the importance of understanding the basics of AC and DC power for any electronic device. The positive wire goes onto the inner silver screw. Then route the positive wire around the outside of the bottom plate. Then the negative wire to the nearest screw holding the bottom plate on. Now to test. As mentioned in one of our prior videos, we are using a regulated DC car adapter, so there will not be any voltage spikes to the Apple TV board. And there you have it folks. Understanding the difference between AC and DC power is crucial for anyone dealing with electronics. We hope this video has shed light on this essential topic. If you found it helpful, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more educational tech content. Until next time, stay informed and keep exploring the fascinating world of technology. Connect with us on social media for updates and let us know in the comments if you've ever encountered power-related issues with your devices. Got an idea for another DIY project? Let us know. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, tech responsibly.